Welcome back to Let's Go Eevee. We found that uh, the Marowak ghost was up in the tower. I believe there is a gym that we can go to over in the city that Team Rocket was controlling. So there's there's two gyms that it looks like we can knock out. Both the Fighting Dojo... Oh, no, the Fighting Dojo is not a gym, is it? Or maybe it is. There's Pokemon Gym in Saffron and one in Celadon that we haven't done. So we haven't done either one of those yet. So we can probably move to both of those right now. How do I get in that? She won't let me through. Her hips don't lie and they don't let me through. You're curious, aren't you? You're curious about me and this machine. You want to know the details? Yes. Okay, if you insist, this machine is a great vehicle that allows you to fly in the sky. It's a marvelous invention, if I do say so myself. It's not an exaggeration to say that it is a secret technique. Sky Dash! Why do you sing a megaphone? <laughs> he's like, he's like, hey, you nasty kid. Do you want me to tell you a cool technique? It'll let you fly. You can fly all over the world if you wanted to. That's like really cool, right? I mean, that seems like the type of man that'd be like, get off my lawn, kid. Uh, where's the gym? Y'all want to hear my catfish story that I got from last night? I figured it was catfish right away, but I wanted to see how it would go. So this guy messages me and he's like really cute. Like probably way, way too hot for me. He sent me photos, super muscular, furry, like very hot guy. But I'm like, I noticed something weird and I like scrolled up and it had like a watermark on it. And I'm like, that's weird. And I, on like one of the other ones, there was a tag on it, like a, so, like somebody's, Instagram tag. Thank you. So I'm like, I don't host. And he's like, oh, I don't host either. And I'm like, okay. So like, because I just wanted to see where it was going to go. I'm like, so where do you want to meet? He's like, well, my friend is out of town and I can get into his apartment. So like, we could go to his apartment if you want. And I'm like, okay, cool. Yeah, let's meet at your, let's break into your friend's apartment. <laughs> And then he, and then I'm like, can I ask you a question before I decide to meet up with you? <laughs> I'm like, why do your photos have a watermark on them? He's, he's like, uh, nothing. And I'm like, there's no reason why your photos have watermarks on them. He's like, nope, it's nothing. So I screenshot the photos and I was like, you know what? I'm okay. I'm, I'm not, I don't want to meet up tonight. He blocks me. So I go and I look it up on Twitter and I find the guy that he took the photos from. And it's an OnlyFans Twitter gay who lives in Texas. I'm in California. And so I messaged him and I was like, hey, I'm sorry for the DM. I'm sure you get a lot of them. I'm just assuming you're not in Texas or, or you're not in California right now, right? And I specified my area so that he knew. And he was like, nope, I'm definitely not. Can you please report the account? And I'm like, cool, I figured so. <laughs> if you're going to catfish, don't keep the watermark. Like, what kind of nonsense? That I did not understand. Oh, is this Erica? Is this Erica's gym? Hello, lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. Mmm, falls asleep. I, I didn't think I was that boring. Hello, ma'am, am, am I boring you? <laughs> are you, are you okay? Oh dear, I must have dozed off. It was because you fought me in soup, huh? He's a dull, dull ass bitch. Welcome, my name is Erica. I'm the leader of the Celadon City Gym. I'm a student of the art of flower arranging. My Pokemon are all grass type. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you perhaps wish to challenge me? You were challenged by gym leader Erica. I like her pose where she's holding her Pokeball so carefully. You can tell that the story they were trying to give us with Erica is that she really respects nature and herself. She's very in tune with the world. And the way that she so gingerly carries this is sweet. Except the way she tossed it. Then <laughs> she was like, fuck this ball. <laughs> I forgot to do this. I need to do that. Yay! My Pokemon avoided the move. It was like, you know what, Shangela? No! Blocked her from getting into the top three. You will not remove her from the competition. If I ever get a Tangela, I'm gonna name it Shangela. I'm not going to apologize for that. Not the Mega Drain. I should have done the bite. That's what I should have done. Damn, you got a lot, didn't you? I'll keep the burn on you, and I'll just do my buzzy buzz again. I feel bad knocking this out. I'm so sorry. I feel bad about it. Ah, just when I healed, too. 
I'm gonna have to use my other uh, fire on you, huh? I'm gonna double burn you, binge. You should not have drained me without consent. I was saving that. This is my last fire move. Oh, thank God, Eevee's the best Pokemon in the universe. I was so stressed. I can see a defeat. You are remarkably strong. You got 5,000 for winning. Thank you. I'm gonna treat myself to Jack in the Box with all that money. I must confer on you a rainbow badge. Do I look like a homosexual to you? Cause you look like you're fruity too. So why don't we can play this game if you want. There's no way I'm gay, bro. Clearly I'm a, I'm straight. I'm clearly a bro. Don't you see the backwards hat, bro? So can I not do the Saffron City gym yet? Is that, is that why it's blocked? Cause I know we can go wake up the Snorlax now. The Pokemon is sprawled out in a deep and comfortable slumber. Do you want to use the Poke Flute? Yes. Why am I playing that into his cooch? Snorlax woke up and is looking at you and it looks hungry. Hey, Chabata! Is it meat soup? Oh, God. Oh, it's an old man. Mr. Fuji says, there's something I forgot to mention when I gave you the Poke Flute. Oh, perfect timing. <coughs> yes, Poncho. You see, this Pokemon is called Snorlax. It's been known to attack the first thing it sees after waking up. Snorlax mistook you for food and attacked. All right, so we're com almost completely out because I did not think to go to the Pokemon Center and heal. I just went and looked at the map. And then I just decided to keep going. So that was really fun. <laughs> oh, it's timed. Oh, that's ass. Snorlax calmed down and gave a huge yawn and returned to the mountains. Oh, too bad, Chibata. There are other Pokemon out there that'll try to attack trainers, just as Snorlax did. When facing such a Pokemon, the best thing to do is defeat it, then catch it. Remember, defeat, then catch. In that order. Well, I'll see you later. I didn't realize it was timed. What kind of gym is this? Poison type? Champ in the making! We have a safari zone here in Fuchsia City. Where you can meet tons of different Pokemon. And the Fuchsia City gym, we welcome trainers who met lots of Pokemon. So, I'll need to see if you manage to catch at least 50 species of Pokemon. What do you mean, your gym? That was a secret disguise person they they said secret plan i should use my intricate style to confound and destroy you in battle as well destroy something zadio strength isn't the only key for pokemon do you understand this i'm an american i don't have to understand anything koga's got a really cool pose Send out wheezing. Wheezing! I remember that's what it sounded like in the anime. Are you kidding me? Did you really just blow yourself up because you were losing? There needs to be a DC penalty on that wheezing right there, because that was nonsensical. I bet rock will do something. Not toxic. It, that shouldn't do much to a rock type, right? I wouldn't imagine that it could. Hell yes. That's what I'm talking about. Really, Poncho Venonat? I will switch you out. I'm going to switch you for Lemon Zest because the Venonat is poison flying. So I can do some damage with Pikachu for now. I've got a pretty good move on Pika that I can do. Venomoth, let's go. Fight you with Thunderbolt. Hopefully that does enough. Oh, that hardly did anything. Bug Buzz. A bug move just knocked me all the way out? <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 wait. A flying move should be good against this. It's a bug type. So flying should be strong against it. We're going to try gust. Oh, but it used protect. Ah, oh, you're such an ass. Oh, I can't stand you. Okay, we're going to try it again. 
Gus should do something pretty strong to this. Not such bomb. That hardly did anything. Okay. I'm gonna heal up Eevee. I'm a little stressed in this battle right now. I wasn't anticipating it going this badly. Jeez. Okay. I don't know what to do here. I have to revive something else. Oh, I have jelly still. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. If Eevee gets knocked out, I can, I'll still be fine. It's weak to fire? Fuck yes. We only have one more. And we still have a Pokemon that we can use as a backup in case it gets to the wire here. Golbat I should be able to mostly take out with Buzzy Buzz. Unless it uses Protect. <laughs> Unless it does that. Okay, we'll see how much it does now. Uh, thank God it didn't work. <laughs> stupid Golbat. You stupid dumb bat. <laughs> Get shit on. <laughs> Get shit on. Your ass. <laughs> Get shit on. Get wrecked. Just as a thought. Trash. <laughs> oh, very good. Now I can Pidgeot. I still need to get one more swapped out so I can get the Pidgeotto. Here, take a soul badge. First, I get told that I'm gay. And now I get told I don't have any soul. I see what's going on here. The Christian agenda has completely invaded the Pokemon world. Now you have a soul badge. Pokemon up to level 60 will heed your command if you if, if you receive them in a trade. Take this too. Toxic from Koga. Sealed within... Mama, that wrist is fruity. This is family. This... Even Pancho agrees. Right? Okay, yeah. You know what? All the signs were there. All the signs were there. I just wasn't paying attention. I've never met a ninja before. Do they have cannon fat asses? If so, I love that. Thank you for healing my Pokemon. They kind of got their shit wrecked. <laughs> just a little bit. So uh, that is going to conclude our adventure this week. We'll pick it back up next week. And we will probably, for next time we do this... We will... Where will we be? I think we're going to go to Seafoam next week. And then Cinnabar. You're and going that's... to SeaWorld? Yes, we're going to SeaWorld. <laughs> so I think that's next time that we play. But uh, yeah, thanks for hanging out with me. Hey, thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, make sure to click that like button. And if you want to see more, hit subscribe. Goodbye!